Good evening, super cool party people, and welcome to quarter to seven on a Sunday evening. It's way too late to be starting a vlog normally, but I got some important things to do. One important thing to do mainly, and that is repack. So this suitcase is packed, but it's way too heavy to lift, so I'm gonna get a tote that suitcase and I have a backpack that I need to dig out of the closet but yeah that's what we're gonna do now so I figured might as well vlog while I do this I guess I can do like a what I'm packing for the summer is that a thing I don't know I don't know so we'll see anyways I need to find a tote before anything else I think and then I'll get started here I suppose yeah when I let my hair air dry it just does the thing I still actually so I had curl cream that I had for the longest time and I loved it and they seem to have stopped making it rude um and that used to tame this this um i found some curl cream that i bought the other day but i just packed it so i haven't tried it yet so hopefully it'll help because otherwise this is gonna be a thing we're gonna have to put it up all the time it's so poofy anyway we are making progress this side has almost all my clothes so i have a pair of rain pants i didn't use them at all last summer i used them in november a lot i'm bringing them anyways um Bikini, bathing suit, workout pants, pajamas, shorts, my awesome onesie that I forgot I had, bra, underwear, jeans, tanks, yeah, I'm, I'm getting there. So I've got pretty much all my clothes moved over. I'm just keeping a list here of things that I need to wash and still want to pack, and I also noticed that I've only packed like two tank tops and no real shirts, so... I need to pack some shirts. I do have a polo shirt for work, but it'll be nice to have an actual like shirts for when I'm not working. Um, I've just got my one sweater on this side, cosmetic stuff, and this guy's almost empty over here. Um, just a couple things, so that should be okay. And my food tote is like packed. I need to put my glass jar in here for my breakfast drinks, but those are all right there so yeah I don't actually have that much in the way of clothes again I kind of knew that because last year I didn't bring a lot uh, it was mostly food in there so it makes sense to have a tote plus because I have the tote it means that I have a laundry basket see worked out really well for me last year other people were like using bags or just throwing them on their floor laundry hamper anyway um, that's how it's going I'm watching Grey's Anatomy oh I also have like all this stuff here that needs to be packed but I still have that backpack so um one of the girls want me to buy this for her and this glasses contacts stationery the frying pans I'm bringing because I learned yeah but I think it should be okay because I still have like one side of the suitcase and my backpack so I think it's gonna be all right and even if I need to like have an extra bag or something, I think it's fine. Whatever, whatever. All right, so I've put up my hair so it's less of a poof ball and um, making progress. I think like that's all packed now. Frying pans, all that. I got a little bit more room maybe for some shirts because I don't have any shirts packed. And then this is basically all my stationary stuff and then my tech stuff will go in here too and my toiletries and there's more toiletries over there. But I'm making progress. It's going pretty well. I'm, um, yeah, I need to do laundry before I can finish packing, and so that's a little bit stressful because I'm not gonna do laundry till tomorrow because, like, I still have a shift at work, so I'll wash my work clothes and stuff too. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling like it's going pretty good. My little tote down here only has a couple things left in it. And then I have my makeup in the bathroom that still needs to go in as well. I think it'll be okay. I don't know. I still feel like it's going to be close for space, especially because of all the tech stuff I need to bring. Like I have this and I need to bring my GoPro stuff, which I haven't even packed yet. And I want to bring some GoPro accessories. So... Yeah, I think I'm going to take a bit of a pause though, um, I'm kind of hungry, it's currently 8 o'clock and I have not eaten dinner, I haven't eaten since about 1, so I'm probably going to go make some hot dogs, if we're being honest, and um, then get back into this I suppose. It's raining, you can't see it but maybe you can hear it. This is nice, it's a nice change because it's just been like 
so dry as you can tell yay okay so I'm making a lot of progress uh, the bin that was down there is empty which is exciting I have my food in the tote there and then the bag inside the bin has my shoes and some chips because they'll get crushed over here I'm severely running out of space now but I've got most everything in it I have those things to fit in the rest of my tech which again is mostly in there and then I still have a little bit of space in there and then I have my makeup as well but I, I, I'm feeling all right I think I'm gonna close that up soon because I've got a few other things on my list which include editing some things so I'm gonna try to get to that now it is nine o'clock oh, it was a long day at work it, I was training and um, it was also just it was seven hours of work with two of us I mean granted there was training so that kind of takes a little while because you know you gotta teach and so yeah so that took a little bit longer but yeah no it's a ah, long day and tomorrow I'm training again and it's my last shift so that's nice at least then it's not my problem um but yeah so fun times I'm going to try to switch focus because I've just been watching Grey's Anatomy like crazy so I'm going to try to switch away from that and edit two videos hopefully um in the next hour that'll happen right it's probably not gonna happen but we're gonna try all right so it's been about whatever many minutes I said I was hoping I could edit two videos in an hour 40 minutes I don't know it's been 40 minutes and I'm just over halfway through the first video my hands hurt so much I think it's just because I've been working so much they're just so painful I uh, it's 10 o'clock now I don't know what to do with myself <laughs> um I don't know what to do should I try to finish this should I try to edit the other one should I just get as much of this done as I can and then give up? I don't know, maybe let's give it another 20 minutes and see. And like I still have to get that stuff off my bed and my body hurts so much. One more shift. One more shift and then on Tuesday my mom and I are going to get pedicures because I want one. I was going to get a manicure too but like I don't want to get nail polish on it and my nails are looking pretty good right now. It won't focus um, so I think that's fine and then if I got them painted then I'd have to remove it. I don't like how that's just too much work. But yeah so I'm gonna go keep editing for a little while longer. Try to stay awake and then figure that out. <laughs> Alright I ended up finishing editing that. It was another 45 minutes. It's quarter to 11 now. What have I done? And I need to now edit this. So yeah like basically today was a packing day. We're mostly packed. I have a little bit of a list here of things I need to make sure I get in there um, after I do laundry and then just stuff that I use on a daily basis so I can't put in there but holy crap tomorrow's my last full day in town. I knew it was coming but wow it has come up fast. Wow. Wow. Anyway with that I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure and I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. <laughs> Good night.